Hey, this is Pete's Dude Man, and we're pretty much wrapping up Vermeyer here. We've uh, just talked to Sovereign, who turns out to be a Reaper. We are facing an actual Reaper, a uh, bringer of galactic, like, mass genocide of, like, everything. So, uh, we're in a lot of deep shit. Uh, hello, Geth Destroyer. You are the least of my problems right now. And now you are dead. Now you're not even a problem. Because you're dead. Geth returning from your position, JSO. Looks like Shadow kicked a sensitive spot. Alenko, head them off. Hold them. Oh, look, this bridge magically opened. Um, I don't know what you Krogan are trying to accomplish. You're trying to long-range shoot me with, like, shotguns or assault rifles. I got a sniper. You're not gonna win this fight. Well, that was that. Uh, what was I leveling up again? Fitness, just for the extra health? Yeah, guess we could do that. Might as well. Bam. Rex, what do we want to work on? We get this and the next level and that's it. I don't even know what to do. Nothing else seems worth it, so I guess we'll go with combat armor. Uh, what about you, Garrus? Last two points. Uh, electronics. All right. All right. We just gotta blow up this facility, and that'll take care of uh, all the stuff we were doing here. Got in this nice, stylish hallway. Oh, that didn't last long. All right, what's in this door? Uh, uh outside. Oh, wait. Can we go down here and get stuff? Yes, we can. I like stuff. Do you like stuff? Stuff is good. And takes a long time to hack, apparently. Alright. What about this crate? Oh, that just had stuff. Whoa. I didn't even get to see what it was. Oh my gosh, we were getting so much stuff. Stuff, 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 stuff. Garrus, I want you to take the medical exoskeleton. Um, I thought I saw new armor types. Is there anything that's good for me? Nope. All right. Lock crate. All righty. What do we get? More stuff. Heavy armor. So maybe some stuff for Ashley later. This Krogan can take a while to kill. Whoa. What? What is going on? Like, Rex, are you just, like, shooting everywhere? Is that what's going on right now? Go get him, Rex! Okay, we got a rocket drone over there. Uh-oh. Bam! Bam! Popped it like a balloon. Oh, we got more. Bam. And I don't want to get snuck up on up. Oh, there we go. Bam. Nice. That went pretty well. Oh, whoops. I accidentally did that. It's me too, Rex. I need to hack into this stuff. Ooh, medium colossus armor? And then, like, Predator blah blah blah? That's gotta be something better. It's gotta be something better. Something better. It's gotta be something better for me. Well, that's amazing. But, what about that? Oh, that is stylish. What about this? Is this even better? 
Oh, it has so little damage protection. Oh, man, but look at everything else that goes with it. Dang. That's a tough choice. Okay, mathematically, 70 more shields, 20 more, or like 30 more almost? Say 25? 25 more damage protection. So like 70 plus 25, that's 95. And then I'm losing not even... Yeah, well, I guess this is better then. Bam! Nah. Nope. Nope. This looks way cooler. This is what we're taking. This looks way cooler. I I am basing my decision off of that. We can give the other armor to Caden. Wait, was it medium or light? I don't remember, but I'm not giving up this armor. Look at how awesome and shiny it is. Um. Oh, we need to deactivate this turret controls. Uh, let's open the supply container. Oh, okay. Good work on the gun, Shadow Team. Now it's our turn. Mind if we join you in the elevator, sir? I suppose you did. Dude, this armor is awesome. That's it. We need to clear the gun and set those charges. Okay. Well, that was that was a simple battle. Jeez. What do we got left? Charge is set. Everyone bunker down. Bunker down. Alright. Looks like we're getting the bomb set up. Alright. Nice work. That's one less thing to worry about. Commander, I'm bringing us in. I'll get as close to the site as I can. Hey, Ashley, do you like my new armor? Uh, hi? Bomb is in position. We're all set here. Commander, do you read me? The nuke is almost ready, Lieutenant. Get to the rendezvous point. Negative, Commander. The Geth have us pinned down on the AA tower. We've taken heavy casualties. Oh, shit! We'll never Kaden. reach the rendezvous point in time. Hold tight. We're coming to get you. Negative. Just make sure that nuke is set. We'll hold him as long as we can. It's okay, Commander. I need a couple of minutes to finish arming the nuke. Go get them and meet me back here. Up to the AA tower. Move. Uh, well, we're still gonna have Rex and Garrus. I don't know why we would have changed our mind on that. I mean, that's just in case you had Ashley or Caden with you, I suppose. Alright, so we need to go save Caden and get out of here. Um, is this the door we're supposed to go through? Nope. What about this door? Uh, nope. Uh, Kaden, I can't figure out how to get to you. Um, I'm assuming down this way, maybe. Wait, did I say I have some equipment? Uh, more stuff. Sweet. Combat exoskeleton sounds fancy.
Uh, is this the way I'm supposed to go? Ah, uh, this looks like it. And we got some uh, enemies in here too. Ah, Krogan. I love how those Polonium rounds just disintegrate them. Oh my gosh, there are a ton of Krogan. Out of my way, we need to save Caden. Oh, crap, that's close. Too close for comfort. Nice shot, Rex. Oh, no! No! No, Caden! We'll never rescue you now! Oh, wait. Oh, uh, there we go. All right. Don't worry, Caden. We're on our way. Huh? Hey, Garrus. My gun. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is a pretty good sniping point. All right. Let's go save Caden. Ooh, crate. Let's open this crate, and then we'll go save Caden. All right. Uh-oh. That's not good. Can you hold them off? There's too many! I don't think we can hold them! I'm activating the nuke! What the hell are you doing, Williams? Making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what! It's done, Commander. Go get the Lieutenant and get the hell out of here! Belay that! We can handle ourselves! Go back and get Williams! This, right here, in my opinion, is still the toughest choice in any Mass Effect game. Whoever we don't choose dies, and they are gone for the entire trilogy. Whoever we do choose to save is with us for the rest of the trilogy. I mean, Caden, we got his tragic backstory, right? And he's, you know, he's a finely tuned soldier, and it'd be such a shame to lose him. Plus, he offers this team you know, no other combination that we're going to see in the future. We will never see another Sentinel like this. On the other hand, Ashley, well, for one, is our romantic interest. We're going we're gonna to get another character like this on this team. We don't have another person on this team who could handle all the weapons. Looking at the mission, she's protecting the bomb, which is critical to this mission, while going here is just a matter of saving Caden himself. This is saving Ashley and the mission. I mean, logically, it seems like we really should save Ashley. You're a good soldier, Kanan. We're gonna miss ya. Williams, radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Yes, Commander, I... It's the right choice, and you know it. Oh, my phone's alarm is going off. That means it's time for me to leave. I'm sorry, Caden. I had to make a choice. I understand, Commander. I don't regret a thing. It sucks that you can't take them both. They're both such fine characters. Alas... This is the end of Caden for us. He was a good soldier through and through. Saw us through a lot of bad times. Helped us out with his biotic powers, his years of experience. He was probably our Shepherd's Card's best friend there, his longest lived ally. And now he's gone. We've got get to make pay for it. Ugh. Stay the fuck away from her, you bastards.
Um, I don't know why I can't Metagel or Shield Boost. I don't think I've used either in a while. Alright, now I can probably use him. Well, we got more Geth somewhere. Maybe some snipers or something. Yep. Had a sniper. Commander, you need to send the nuke and get out. We can't hold. Left flank, left flank. Suppressing fire. Suppressing. Whoa. Whoa. Oh shit. Oh shit. It's Siren. Holy fuck. Whoa. Ah, uh, crap. We can't hurt him. I applaud you, Shepard. My Geth were utterly convinced the Salarians were the real threat. An impressive diversion. Of course, it was all for nothing. I can't let you disrupt what I've accomplished here. You can't possibly understand what's really at stake. Why are you doing this? You've seen the vision from the beacon, Shepard. You of all people should understand what the are capable of. They cannot be stopped. Do not mire yourself in pointless revolt. Do not sacrifice everything for the sake of petty freedoms. The Protheans tried to fight, and they were utterly destroyed. Trillions dead. But what if they had bound before the invaders? Would the Protheans still exist? Is submission not preferable to extinction? Do you really believe the Reapers will let us live? Now you see why I never came forward with this to the Council. We organics are driven by emotion instead of logic. We will fight even when we know we cannot win. But if we work with the Reapers, if we make ourselves useful, think how many lives can be spared. Once I understood this, I joined Sovereign. Though I was aware of the dangers, I had hoped this facility could protect me. You're afraid Sovereign is influencing you. You're afraid he's controlling your thoughts. I've studied the effects of indoctrination. The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. That is my saving grace. How is that a saving grace? The sovereign needs me to find the conduit. My mind is still my own. For now. But the transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. Why are the Geth following Sovereign? They believe Sovereign to be some kind of god, the pinnacle of their own evolution. But the reaction of their deity is most telling. It is insulted. Sovereign does not desire the pitiful devotions the Geth hurl at it. They are just tools, and no amount of belief on their part will change that. But as tools, they are useful. They will survive the coming invasion. If organic life is to survive, we must also prove we are useful. We must work with the Reapers. Tell me why Sovereign needs the Conduit. Tell me what it is. Maybe we can find a way to stop them. The Conduit is the key to your destruction and my salvation. Sovereign needs my help to find it. That is the only reason I have not been indoctrinated. Sovereign's manipulating you, and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. If I find the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve from the inevitable. This is my only hope. Together, we can stop Sovereign. We don't have to submit to the Reapers. We can beat them. I no longer believe that, Shepard. The visions cannot be denied. Reapers are too powerful. The only hope of survival is to join with them. Sovereign is a machine. It thinks like a machine. If I can prove my value, I become a resource worth maintaining. There is no other logical conclusion. You were a specter. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. It is inevitable. My way 
is the only way any of us will survive. So Saren's intentions are not necessarily evil. He can be reasoned with. And machines. And in doing so, I will save more lives than have ever existed. He's still wrong, though. The Sovereign is obviously just manipulating him to get what he wants. Or get what it wants. Well, we'll have to die in the next episode. I got a jet.